Welcome to Mombasa Lighthouse Church Online, and we are glad that you have joined us again this Sunday. And we thank God that he has continued to bless you and sustain you throughout the week. We know it has been tough and it continues to be tough, but the Lord has always been on our side. I just want to share a word from 1 Peter chapter 3, from verse, uh, in, in verse 12 in the NLT translation. It says, The eyes of the Lord watch over those who do right, and his ears are open to, those, to their prayers. But the Lord turns his face against those who do evil. Amen. So let's be encouraged to know that the Lord's eyes are upon us, and he hears our prayers, and whenever we call upon him, he answers. So let's pray. Father, we thank you. We bless your name. Thank you for a wonderful, beautiful day today, O oh God. We come into your courts with thanksgiving and praise, my God. I pray this, this day, O oh God, that even as we come before you, Lord, that, Father, we will please you, O God. That, Lord, you will restore us, O God. You will forgive us, Lord. And, Father, we pray even for our families, our friends, our leaders, our neighbors, even our counties and our country, O God. We pray, O Lord, that you may continue, Lord, being God over this nation, O God, because you rule and reign over everything and you own everything on this earth, my God. We thank you even for a time in your presence, O God. Bless each one of us. Let your holy presence go with us. And let your Holy Spirit come and refresh us and minister to us, O King of Glory. We want to thank you and to bless your name. And it is in the mighty name of Jesus that I do pray, trust, and believe. Amen. Amen. Let's join the worship team in a time of praise. One thing we ask of you, one thing that we desire. Lord, as we worship you, Lord, come and change our lives. One thing we ask of you, one thing that we desire. Lord, as we worship you, Lord, come and change our lives.
church we trust that you're well on this 23rd of august day and that you're still encouraged our giving scripture comes from the book of second corinthians chapter 9 from verse 10 to 11 the amplified version now he who provides seed for the sower and bread for food will provide and multiply your seed for sowing that is your resources and increase the harvest of your righteousness which shows itself in active goodness, kindness, and love, will be enriched in every way so that you may be generous. And this generosity administered through us is producing thanksgiving to God from those who benefit. To send your giving, send them to the M-Pesa pay bill number 247-247. Account number is 046-026-366. 9660. Let us pray for the givings. Heavenly Father, give us wisdom to know what to give and whom to give. Change our attitude towards giving, knowing all things come from you, and it is from the bountiful supply you have graciously poured into our laps. Give us, we pray, a giving heart, a generous heart, and a grateful heart a heart filled with thanks and praise to you for your provision. In the mighty name of the risen Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Church, remember to send the details to the number shown on your screen, the Mpesa transaction code, the amount you give, and the reason for giving. Thank you so much for your cooperation. God bless you, and join us as we go to the Lord's presence in worship, in truth and in spirit. See you next time. Come on, just get up on your feet.
just take this time to thank the Lord for who He is in your life right now. Yes, the week might have been tough, but you survived because you had God. The Bible says He's the author and the finisher of our faith. So even right now, just raise your hands. We love you, Jesus.
Confirmation over our lives. We magnify your name. 